I've done that the same. I've not always had easy lives, so that was the way we kept it clean through coming to the bar. And there uh, once, well, me and we had lined up outside for about two hours, there and on. But when it used to come to the afternoon, my husband used to send me a jug of tea and toast over. So everybody had tea and toast, and about two or three children out there with tea and toast. But, uh, of course, it has altered here since, because them uh, washing machines were never here. We used to do everything by hand, and uh, then what we put our washing in, they used to be on the floor, we used to have to pull a big lever to get them to go round. But I think myself, nobody should go dirty while this is here. Of course it's altered now because you see the people are all been rehoused that they don't come so you don't see them but it used to be a, a, a chaos here but Friday morning it was it used to be you know because moving people don't come but I do come from Acme I do come here to do my washing I get, I two buses don't get on them on Friday morning <laughs> to get here I've been coming here since I was 14 and now I'm 73 so, I mean, it's, uh, so that's how hard it is. <laughs> <laughs> it's about time they should let me come in here for nothing. Yeah, right, no. <laughs> to two of us. Yeah. But I like the elbow grease. I yeah. Rub it, brush. Yeah. Especially all round the cuffs and the collars, and they make me over all dirty. You rub and rub and rub. That's what I like, what you call elbow grease. To me, a laundry, I think, is a waste of time. I think so, anyway. I might be wrong, but they don't get them as clean. But uh, I like coming here for all. I mean, because I mean, people I don't see all the week living up at and they live this way. When I come, I meet the people I've always been used to meeting. You know what I mean? Early turn this week. Oh, yeah. He doesn't like that very much. Oh, not really. Have a good laugh, you know. Stand and say what we used to do, what we used to never do. So cold. You used to take in a bit of washing. <laughs> so cold. That's how you be a conversation. And then last thing used to be, I see you at the bar for Friday. I'm like a range worse, you'll come round to me. I mean, when I come here on Friday morning, I get off the bus. When I, I, I generally meet people staying at the bus stop. I say, hello, Martha. I ain't seen you for a long time when you want to get up in the morning. See, so I mean, you have a joke before you come in here, then you finish your little bits of, uh, of fun in here where you have a, have a joke with one and the other, you know what I mean? It's like one of them lines. But uh, I would be sorry if it shut up. I wouldn't come this way to see any friends, would I? And I wouldn't know nothing then, would I? See, that's, I mean, that, that is the thing. I don't know if they're going to alter it in any way, but if they altered it, I'd still come. I'd still come to you if I altered it, you know. Because I would be amongst the people I've always been used to being with. Because half of these people that see and come from Bethlehem Green, well, I've lived in Bethlehem Green all my life. But I'd still come here, and I'd come here every day. If I couldn't get here one day, I'd come the next day. I'd do the washing. So I wouldn't miss it if I did come one day, I'd have to come another. You know. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, sunset is why we come in here. I they don't shut, that's all. I mean, would not see them shut. <laughs> so I'd best go take my bit of washing up now, when I? <laughs> I don't want to get it done at all. <laughs>